Simplify this expression. Cubic root of 5 times square root of 2 plus 7 minus cubic root of 5 times square root of 2 minus 7. Pause the video, give it a real try, and do not use a calculator. It's not about the final answer, it's about the process. Okay, good luck. Hello guys, this is Daily Math. Today we're going to simplify this expression, and I think it's a fun problem. So, let's go. Okay, what we have here are two cubic roots, and what we do is taking it to the power of three, obviously, and then let's just hope for the best. Okay, so let's call it x, and we're going to find x. Okay, and we can also call this one a minus b. This one is a, and this one is b. So x cubed is a cubed minus b cubed minus three times a squared b plus three times a b squared. And we can also write the second part as, let's say, minus three times a b multiplied by a minus b. Okay, so we have x cubed equals um, first one to the power of three. We can just get rid of the radical. We say five times square root of two plus seven minus b cubed. That's um, five times square root of two that's a double negative, becomes positive, plus 7. Um, minus 3 times AB multiplied by A minus B. And what was A minus B? That's X. Awesome. So what's A times B? That's cubic root of 25 times 2 minus 7 to the power of 2, 49. And that's cubic root of 50 minus 49 that equals to 1 great therefore we have x cubed equals and these two terms cancel out right 7 plus 7 minus 3 times 1 x so we got ourselves a cubic equation x cubed plus 3 times x minus 14 equals 0 let's solve this one what is x x is the expression we had at the beginning and if you find x it's just like we have simplified it all right so how do we solve this x cubed plus 3 times x minus 14 equals 0 if we try 0 that doesn't fit obviously what about 1 1 plus 3 minus 14 doesn't fit but if we try 2 I can say 2 to the power of 3 plus 3 times 2 minus 14. It's 8 plus 6 minus 14. That's 0. That fits. So x equals 2 is a root for this cubic equation and is an answer for this. And let me tell you something. For this expression, we don't need to find the other two roots because it's a real expression leads to only one real answer and that's two and let me show you that there are no other real solutions there are just two imaginary solutions if you want to find them so what we do here is we divide the expression x cubed plus 3 times x minus 14 by x minus 2 for the first one we need to have x squared then we multiply by both of them then we have x cubed minus 2 times x squared and there's a minus sign so 2 times x squared plus 3 times x minus 14 and here we need 2 times x 2 times x squared minus 4 times x and then we should subtract it here we have 7 times x minus 14 for this we say plus 7 7 times x minus 14 all good this is what we were looking for so we can say x cubed plus 3 times x minus 14 is equal to x minus 2 times x squared plus 2 times x plus 7 so we found one answer which was x equals 2 
and there is no real solution for this one because b squared minus 4 times ac for this quadratic equation is 4 minus 28 and that's less than 0 that's negative there's no real solution for this one and x equals 2 is the only answer okay that's enough investigating this expression we simplify it we did everything and it's time to say goodbye have a good time with this ugly friend of mine <laughs>